Um, I believe women should have both qualities. For example, when I'm on the field, I will portray a very strong personality while constantly making decisions. While I'm off the field, I tend to lean more towards the feminine side, as I believe having both of these qualities could reflect the image of modern women these days. Every surgery that I've gone through, I knew that there might be a risk of never being able to play ever again. But I'm willing to take the risk as I'm more afraid that I will regret open giving up. Badminton has taken up the majority of my time. The best moment of my life is when I was standing on the podium during the Rio 2016 Olympics. Did in my heart. Yes, Dad, I did this. I finally fulfilled your dream for you. That was definitely the greatest moment of my life. Personally, I value all the players because each of them have their own merits and I have learned a lot from them. But if I were to choose one, I would say it is Dato Wira Lee Chong Wei. I admire the self-discipline that he had and appreciate his constant guidance for us as a senior. Because in order to break through, it might be a one-shot thing, but to consistently stay at top and maintain at that level, it takes years of experiences, self-discipline and attitude. Chinese have this saying, 10% talent, 90% hard work. There is no shortcuts to success. It's all about persistence, self-discipline and attitude. I remember when I first shared this candy with them, they told me that is a very tasty and addictive. But what they didn't know is that I'm the brand ambassador of this candy. So every time I will play it cool by telling them that, yeah, I'm actually the ambassador of the candy and give them a pack of candy.